Hello friends, a welcome to Fun Learning. So if you want to prep up and crack competitive exams like the Olympiads, ASET or any talent search exam, well this is the place for you. So do subscribe to our channel where we bring you last year papers and also challenging questions to help you prepare for these upcoming exams. So in this video, we are going to solve the Cyber Olympiad paper for grade 2 that was held in December 2019. And we are doing it across two videos that is part 1 and part 2. So let's get started with our paper solving. Let's start with solving our NCO that is the National Cyber Olympiad for grade 2 for the year 2019-20. This has the three section, logical reasoning, computer and IT and achiever section. So our first section is the logical reasoning section. The first question here is, study the pattern 1, 2 and 3 given in these images here. Using the same pattern, tell the number of mice in pattern 6. Is it option A 15, option B 12, option C 13 or option D 20? Your time starts now. So let's look at this together. Now our pattern 1 has 3 mice, our pattern 2 has 5 mice and our pattern 3 has 7 mice. That means each pattern is shifting or adding 2 mice to itself to get to the next pattern. So if we draw a number line with 6 spots and we increment each by 2 steps. So starting with 3, we add 2 steps which is 5. Adding 2 steps is 7. Another 2 steps to 7 is 9. Another jump of 2 steps from 9 is 11. And final jump is 13. So that means our 6th pattern is going to have 13 mice in its figure. So that's our right answer option C. Next question. Which of the following figures does not have any curved line? Is it option A the mouse? Is it option B the conical hat? Is it option C the ball? Or option D the brick? Your time starts now. So a curved line is something like this and of the given figures the only figure without any curved line that is only of straight lines is option D the brick. Next question. Which of the following clocks shows 20 minutes past the time shown in the given clock? This is the given clock. You need to choose the right answer from option A, B, C or D. Your time starts now. Let's look at this together. So the given clock shows the time of 3 o'clock. And we need to find the clock which shows 20 minutes past. That means we add 20 minutes to 3 which is 3.20. And of the given clocks it is option A which shows the time to be 3.20. So that's our right answer. Next question. 5 groups of dash bottles each can be formed from the given bottles. So here there are some given bottles. You need to choose your answer from option A4, option B5, option C6 or option D8. Your time starts now. Well, let's look at this together. So there are 20 bottles given here of which we need to make 5 groups. That means we need to divide 20 into 5 equal groups. And 20 divided by 5 is equal to 4. So your right answer is option A. Next question. If a comb is called a mirror, a mirror is called a hairband and a hairband is called a clip, then we can see our face in dash. Is it option A the mirror, option B the hairband, option C the clip or option D the comb? Your time starts now. Well, let's look at this together. Now, the relationship here is that the comb is called the mirror, mirror is called the hairband and hairband is called the clip. And we can see our face in a mirror. But what is a mirror called? 
a mirror is called a hair band so your right answer is option b the hair band now let's go to our next section which is the computer and it section the first question here is which of the following statements is or are correct regarding the given device this is the device here is it option a it is a smart machine option b it can store information like words numbers and pictures option c it works when it gets orders from you or option d all of these time starts now well the device that is shown in the picture is a computer which is a smart machine can store information like words number picture and it works when it gets inputs from you or orders from you so the right answer is option d all of these next question which of the following statement is or are incorrect about computers a it can be used for counting population b it can be used for voting c it cannot be used to predict weather conditions or d both a and b your time starts now well let's look at this together now here the right answer is option d both a and b because it cannot be used for counting population we need to manually go and count and then feed the information to computer similarly it cannot be used for voting it can only be used to feed information inside and then get a result of voting so our right answer is a and b are incorrect statements about computers next question Which type of computer technology is shown in the given image? This is the image here. Is the right answer A laptop, B tablet, C palm top or D touch screen? Your time starts now. So the right answer here is touch screen because option A, B and C these are devices. These are not technology. Touch screen is a computer technology which allows you to interact with the screen using a finger touch. Let's go to our next question. The given image shows the use of computer in dash. Look at the image here. Is it option A hospital? Is it option B railways? Is it C defense or D sports? Your time starts now. Well if you look at the image these are army men who are looking into the computer for some information or for looking at the maps so the right answer is option C defense next question what would be the result if you perform the following step when caps lock is on step 1 press shift and the number 1 step 2 press h step 3 is press shift and the number 8 is it option A B C or D your time starts now Well let's look at this together so caps lock is on means if you click on any letter it will be capital letter so our step one is press shift and one so whenever you press shift it is the function key that is the image that is on top of the number that will show that means for step 1 you will get a exclamation mark step 2 is press h remember the caps lock is on so you will get a capital h step 3 is again press shift and number 8 that means it is the star that will get displayed or the asterisk that will get displayed so your answer matches what is there in option a so that's your right answer next question the given device is used in A railway for booking train tickets B theaters for booking movie tickets C supermarkets for billing purposes or D library for keeping records your time starts now Well let's look at this together well this is actually your billing machine so it is a supermarket for billing purposes where you select the items here and then the bill is generated next question 
Sam has performed the following steps to draw a rectangle in MS Paint. Which of the following tools will be there in place of question mark in the given steps? Step 1. Select what? What do you need to select to draw a rectangle? Step 2. Point the mouse on drawing area. Step 3. Click and drag the mouse once to draw a rectangle. Is it option A, B, C or D? Well, if you remember what looks like your MS Paint screen, you will know that you need to select the rectangle first and then follow step 2 and 3. So your answer is option B. Next question. A three button mouse is shown here. What is the most common use of the middle button as indicated in this mouse? A. Selecting an object on the screen. B. To close a window. C to view a context menu or D to scroll the page. Time starts now. When the right answer here is the mouse with the center scroll is to scroll a page that is option D. Next question. How can you take proper care of your computer? A by keeping it in a hot room. B by keeping it in a cool and dust free room, C by allowing moisture around the computer or D all of these. Your time starts now. Well, the right answer here is option B that is by keeping it in a cool and dust free room. This is required because computer is a machine and on usage it does become warm. Hence, this is the right answer. Next question. Identify the computer part hidden in the jumbled word. This is the jumbled word here. You need to unjumble this and choose whether it is A, B, C or D. The time starts now. Well, to unjumble, you should write the letters in a circular way so that by selecting, you don't have a bias on the letters. And the unscrumbled answer is joystick, which is nothing but your option A, which shows the image of joystick. Next question. Computers at home can be used for dash. A. Cleaning the room. B. Washing clothes. C. Irrigation and water supply or D. Chatting with friends. Time starts now. Well, it is not used for option A, B and C. They are manual work but what it is used is for chatting with friends. So that's our right answer option D. Next question. Which of the following is the correct sequence regarding the given IPO cycle that is the input, processing and output cycle. These are the three images given with X, Y and Z. You need to choose the right answer from A, B, C and D. Time starts now. So first you will take the lady finger that is X. Second step is you will take it to the chopping board that is Z. And third step is what you get the output that is Y that is the chopped lady figure. So your IPO cycle is option C which is X is input, Z is process and Y is output. Well with this we will take a break and the remaining questions we will look in the next video. Hope you enjoyed this part of the question paper. Take a break and then click on the link to get on to the next part. Well, till we see you again, take care.